Hey guys, hope you're doing well. The job market is forever changing in Canada and jobs have been fluctuating in and out of demand especially because of COVID-19. Many factors such as economics, social trends and industrial change contribute to the demand of a particular NOC or job profile and understanding which jobs may be in demand in the coming year 2022 is really crucial to planning your career path and putting yourself in a job profile that will be rewarding in your years to come in Canada. Now the list of jobs that will be in demand in the next year in 2022 is likely to follow trends that were established in the previous two years that is 2020 and 2021. As many Canadians continue to work from home, there is an increase in available work that can be done remotely as well. In this video, I'm going to explain why some jobs are likely to remain in demand in the coming year, 15 job profiles or NOCs that are likely to remain in high demand in 2022 and the average salary for each one of them, so do watch the video till the end. Hey guys, this is Jason from Dream Canada. If you're new to the channel, I show people how to save their money and immigrate to new countries through my videos without the help of any immigration consultants or agents or lawyers. You can find all the process instructions for you to apply on your own through this channel. Subscribe now because all the information provided here is completely free and I'll answer all your queries in the comment section and on my social handles on Instagram and Twitter. So don't forget to follow us there as well. The first ones that make the list are project managers. Project managers organize, plan and oversee the progress and completion of important projects in a company or a business. The main focus is to ensure that all projects undertaken are completed on time, within budget and to all the decided specifications. They may be from a number of different fields such as construction, IT or any other industry that oversees the completion of larger scale projects. The role is essential to the success of many businesses and they are likely to remain in demand in 2022 as well. The average annual salary of a project manager is around $75,000 which is a great amount. The next one is software developers. Software developers test and develop software components until it meets their clients needs. They also perform quality assurance on software, upgrade existing applications and facilitate documentation for software systems. The software that they develop allow users to perform certain tasks on computers and phones such as playing a game or entering information into a database. Because software developers can work from home and there's an ever increasing demand for new software, there's also a steady demand for project developers in the coming year. The average annual salary of a software developer is around $76,000. Next we come to accountants. Accountants oversee the cash flow in and out of a company. Besides preparing financial reports and tax returns, they also keep detailed records of a company's financial activity. There is actually an ongoing shortage of accountants, which means that this job will most likely stay in demand in 2022 as well. The average annual salary of an accountant in Canada is around $53,000. Registered nurses have also been in huge demand these past couple of years. They assist medical personnel for their medical tests, communicate with patients and maintain patient records. They may be integral in developing and implementing nursing care plans. Since there is a heavy public reliance on the healthcare system as healthcare is free in Canada, there has always been a particularly high demand for registered nurses, licensed practical nurses and nurse practitioners which will probably continue into 2022. The average annual salary of registered nurses is a huge $81,000 which speaks volumes of their demand. The next one on the list are customer service representatives. CSRs communicate with customers online or over the phone to handle complaints, queries or to take orders. They play a key role in maintaining customer satisfaction and dealing with logistics and sales departments to take orders or to organize deliveries. The increase in online and over the phone shopping along with deliveries and logistics over these past years means that customer service representatives are likely to be in high demand in 2022 as well. The average annual salary of a customer service representative is around $57,000. A huge chunk of jobs available in Canada belong to sales associates. Sales associates mainly assist customers in locating products or services in a retail environment. They are the first point of contact for you and I as consumers and they complete transactions for a product or service purchased. As sales associates are essential to the success of the businesses that employ them, they will definitely continue to be in high demand in 2022 as well. The average annual salary of sales associates is around $60,000. On a related note, merchandisers have also been in fair demand over these years. They maintain and replenish the stock in retail establishments like supermarkets or grocery stores. 
They deal with store managers in order to maintain a steady supply of merchandise through their outlets. Merchandisers may also work in warehouses as part of the inventory teams. Regardless of work environment, there's a consistently high demand for new products, so merchandising is a promising job prospect even for 2022. The average annual salary for merchandisers is a huge figure of $76,000. Next, we have human resource managers. Now we can't have job placements without human resource teams, so they play an integral role serving as a link between potential employees like you and me and the management team of companies. They also lead admin tasks, manage junior HR employees and work closely with senior management teams on their human resource needs. They may even be in charge of allocating resources of a company like their budget, time, staff and technology. Since this role is so critical to many businesses, it's likely to remain in huge demand through 2022. Human resource managers are paid a hefty sum of around $72,000 per year due to their integral part in the functioning of any company. Next, we come to network administrators. Network administrators mainly configure network hardware, handle repairs and maintenance, and manage software for a company. As part of the IT department, they specialize in keeping company computer networks running free from technological or security issues. As more businesses employ remote workers, technical support staff such as network administrators are particularly essential in maintaining business functionality and this will continue throughout 2022. The average annual salary for network administrators is close to around $65,000. Financial advisors also make the cut here. Financial advisors are accounting professionals that help businesses and individuals make more money through their advice on savings and investment strategies. They manage their investment portfolios like SIPs and create structured plans for their finances. As people have always had to diversify their income and investments, these advisors have become in demand and are likely to remain in demand in the future as well. The average annual salary for financial advisors is around $59,000. Administrative assistants are next on the list. Admin assistants, as the name suggests, provide administrative support to a company's management team and ensures that they operate efficiently. Some of their duties include answering phone calls, scheduling meetings and appointments and sending and receiving correspondence. Because administrative assistants can do their roles remotely, it's likely to be in demand in 2022 as well. The average annual salary for admin assistants is around $55,000. Electrical engineers are next on the list. Electrical engineers test electrical systems and equipment. They can specialize in automotive, entertainment or even airplane systems. Because of the ever-increasing reliance on automation and computer systems right now, Electrical engineers have become and continue to be in high demand. Electrical engineers provide essential support that not only the public rely on but essential workers as well and as such their demand will remain strong even in 2022. The average annual salary for electrical engineers is close to around $73,000. Truck drivers have always been in huge demand in Canada. Canada has a really huge well-connected road network and more than 70% of goods transported in Canada are transported by trucks. Truck drivers are in charge of transporting goods and daily commodities using large and small vehicles across long and short distances. They are an essential part of logistics operations and a key element in supply chains. Since an increasing number of customers are ordering their goods online now, there is more movement of products across the country than ever before. This is likely to be the case in 2022 as well, making truck driving a high demand job for the year. Due to the huge demand, truck drivers are paid quite handsomely at around $70,000 per year, but keep in mind that they do also have a lot of expenses to incur as well. Welders also make up a large proportion of the jobs in demand in Canada. Their main duties are to build or repair various products, goods or structures. They are key to maintaining the structural integrity of items made of metal, such as housing, commercial structures, cars, bridges, ships or aircraft. Welders may even specialize in particular fields such as underwater welding which pays really well. With the continuing shortage of tradespeople, welders will likely remain in high demand for 2022. The average annual salary for welders is around $52,000. General laborers have also continued to be in constant demand in Canada. General laborers may include anyone working in carpentry, masonry, farming, warehouses, packaging and many such related fields. They play an important role in the grunt work for construction sites, farms or any other work site that requires manual labor. 
They may move materials, perform construction tasks, or do basic maintenance or keep of buildings and machines. Assembly line staff, construction workers, and farm laborers are predicted to be in high demand for 2022 due to the ongoing shortage. General laborers can make around $40,000 per year in Canada. All right, guys, so those were the 15 top jobs that will continue to be in demand in Canada in the next year in 2022. For more immigration and travel tips, subscribe to this channel now. Do like this video if you like the content and comment what topic you would like to hear about next. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to subscribe for regular updates on immigration and don't forget to follow us on Instagram as well. I wish you the best of luck for your application and hope you have a great day.